Python 2 versus Python 3. I'm going to just quickly cover some of the differences. Okay, as you may recall, when we type Python, we're using Python 2 on the CL server. And when we type Python 3, we're using Python 3. So for this demonstration, whenever I am typing a command with Python as the first word, that will be Python 2. And if I type a command with Python 3, that would be Python 3. Okay. So probably one of the most frequently encountered and obvious differences between Python and Python 3 is the syntax of the print statement. And I'm going to just change up my quotes here. So as to not confuse double quotes with single quotes. But as you can see, I'm able to execute this print statement without any parentheses. Python 3, on the other hand, will cause the syntax error to be risen. Okay, so we'll fix that. Oops, I mean that. And now with the parentheses, Python 3 is happy. We could keep the parentheses for Python 2, and Python 2 will also be happy. So maybe a good rule of thumb is to always include print statements inside, or always include parentheses inside your print statements. All right, another difference happens with the behavior of division in Python 2 versus Python 3. So if we print 4 divided by 5 in Python 2, we get 0. But if we print 4 divided by 5 in Python 3, we get 0.8, which is accurate. So what's going on? Python, uh, Python 2 is performing integer division at this point. So in other words, it's evaluating this division to somewhere between 0 and 1, and then taking the floor, which simply means to round down. And so this integer division takes place by default in Python 2. Python 3, the default is float division. What's a float? A float is simply a decimal point number, is a good way to think about it. And 4 divided by 5 then evaluates to 0.8. We can do floating point division in Python 2, but in this instance we would have to cast our integer to a float. Another way to cast an integer to a float is to explicitly give it a decimal point. And you notice that in each of these cases, uh, I only have to change the data type from int to float for one of the numbers in this problem. I could also have changed 5 into a float with the same result. Python 3, its default is floating point division, but we can force it to do integer division, and the shorthand for that is to use two slashes instead of one for division. Zero. There are some cases where integer division may be ideal if we're dealing in a data type or our data makes sense as integers more than it does as floats. Okay, so we can do integer division and floating point division in Python 3 uh, and Python 2. Um, 
but 1 Python 2 defaults to integer division and Python 3 defaults to floating point division.